so many years but I'm still his biggest number one fan. I'm really excited about celebrating Mario, you know, he's, um, I, I adore Mario, he's uh, enormously talented, I've worked with him for so many years um, and he's, he's a friend and somebody who I respect and admire enormously so yeah, I think it's a pretty amazing day uh, for Mario so I'm looking forward to giving him a big hug and, and celebrating and raising a glass to him. I am so honoured, as you said, because he's my friend and, you know, this is his 30 years of being in the industry and I'm so lucky to have been able to work with him as much as I have and he's a really close friend and I love him enormously, so I'm very, very flattered and terrified and all of those things. I never really go to shows, I go to Macaulay and he's a great friend. Honestly, I'm really fortunate and I've worked with some amazing people, but Mario has this ability to make you feel special and it's it's kind of his greatest gift and as a result of that in a really terrifying environment when it's vogue and you know you feel completely intimidated and unworthy you have this man there who is just ebullient and brilliant and kind and so it's always fun it's like a day with your friends I mean he's that's why he gets such good pictures because he is so open and warm and loving so he's yeah he's completely worthy of this award I gratefully accepted it because it is my 30th anniversary and this is like the celebration of those 30 years. You know, it's really embarrassing in a funny way because, <laughs> you know, I don't want them to feel like they have to do something for me. But, Are you kidding? But, you know, it's, um, it's an amazing thing. I started in this country and it's incredible to be honored in this country. I've been honored in different places, but coming back here is like an amazing thing because these are the people that helped me struggle through it, you know, and that believed in me and taught me and I mean, I, of course, Sienna is a lot younger than me, so she wasn't a <laughs> part of that world back then, but yeah, but it's, um, I don't know, it's very touching. Well, my career wasn't as successful like this from day one. It's been a, a long struggle and um, but I think that that's the fun of it. When things are quickly successful, you quickly drop them as well, no? And I have to say, I have been, I know, I've, I still struggle. You know, people don't believe it. They think, oh, Mario Tessino, he has everything. But it isn't really like that. Nobody ever has everything because as the more you get trained in your field, the more you realize the things that you haven't achieved than other people might have. So it's a constant struggle. I think he's just kind of, you know, set the bar and he's kind of out there as a leader of creating amazing fashion images and he's definitely one of a kind.